progress in any society requires a common understanding among its people. This is the founding principle behind the George C. Marshall Center, located near the base of Germany's tallest peak in Garmisch, and the site for the UCOM-hosted European Security Seminar. While the seminar spoke on many issues concerning the NATO allies and partner nations, none garnered as much attention as the current trend of Russian aggression in Ukraine. Yet, from the beginning, there was a clear message that was agreed upon. First of all, assure allies and assure partners, and to deter further aggression. <clears throat> this, of course, is not an easy task, especially when dealing with the concerns of so many nations. It requires talking about and finding solutions to everyone's concerns. The most important thing is that we discussed about uh, the future of NATO, the way we see the security environment right now, this, what's going on in Ukraine, and what could the partners and the allies do to address better this issue. The question is, however, how do you address the issue when dealing with so many nations and their needs? Simply put, it requires the nations to come together to speak with one voice, one message. And that message has to address the current realities and tragedies. The latest incident with the shootdown of the Malaysian Airlines gives a sense of urgency to what has already been frayed. That we have to remember that Russia has illegally annexed part of Ukraine. And that action in itself led to the severing uh, and the, the stoppage of all cooperation with Russia through ec with exercises and training. This, however, may not be enough to halt the aggression of the Russian bear. Much like families, allies often disagree and don't see eye to eye on certain situations. But the need for security will lead the allies and partners to build a common message and a common purpose. Sometimes we have, all, all, of course, disputes and we uh, see things differently because, you know, we live in different environment. And it's important to share uh, our picture of our environment to other nations. And we, we have to, to have uh, a common uh, approach to the to the, to the regional security. Through their continued common purpose and cooperation, the nations represented here today show that progress is being made, and that progress is continuing to build a mountain of trust that will stand as tall and as strong as the mountain before them. Reporting from Garmisch, Germany, for AFN Stuttgart, I'm Staff Sergeant Chris Jelly.